I, I can't get past the fact that she looks like the shit emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, people are thinking that Lizzo finally responded to Aries Spears and what he had to say on the art of dialogue. What's good, everybody? This your boy, JTL, a.k.a. Opposite from the norm. Back with another one. Before I get started, make sure y'all subscribe and hit that notification bell. All right. So over the weekend, the VMAs happened and shout out to Lizzo. She won an award and she had something to say within that acceptance speech. Let's get to it. This is brought by the Shade Room. It's about damn time. Lizzo was the internet's trending topic over the weekend due to some unsavory comments that went viral about her appearance. And she used her winning moment to speak out against the hate. The Grammy Award winning singer took to the stage at the 2022 VMAs to accept the Video for Good Award tonight. Seemingly addressed comedian Aries Spears who called her out in an interview. In her speech, she said, and now to the bees that got something to say about me in the press she yelled into the mic you know what i'm not gonna say nothing she paused and continued they'd be like lizzo why don't you clap back and she says because b i'm winning ho big b's winning ho the best revenge is your paper b <laughs> oh man if you say it's so big girl but not only that, I'm gonna play the video clip real quick of what she had to say to her so-called And now, to the that got some say about me in the press. You know, I'm not gonna say nothing. They be like, why don't you clap, clap? Okay, so somebody has something to say. This is the shade room. Hashtag Lizzo kept it real cute when dressing the folks that mentioned her in the press during VMA acceptance speech for video for good. How y'all think she handled it? All right, so let's just keep it real, guys. It's a great thing that the sister's doing a thing. The sister's doing a thing. She, she's, you know, she's successful. But the problem is she's not winning in the way that she thought she would for us, i.e. relationships. It's different from men and women. When men become successful, get more money, things of that nature, he's gonna come become more attractive to women because women actually like guys that are winning because it means that they're winning. They're gonna provide for them. So unless a woman is gonna provide for a man, we don't care about your money, your degrees and stuff like that. And that is the biggest reason why. It doesn't really do anything for us. Like, it, you might be, you know, good arm candy, like, you know, when Jay got with Beyonce, but Jay is the primary breadwinner. He makes the most, he, he's, he's a billionaire. And Beyonce, she got about four or 500 million, so trust me, that ain't nothing to sneeze at. But at the same time, can we really see Beyonce getting with a guy that has less than her? No. So, at the same time, if Lizzo is really winning, then why are you always on the internet crying? These are the things we gotta, we gotta talk about. And I'm sorry, but people don't like you showing off your body like that. They say body positivity and all that BS whatever you want to call it because if men do it they get clowned all the time don't they don't nobody care but the difference is they're men so they're gonna get women because they're successful and it don't matter that's just how it goes i'm sorry so shout out to the art of dialogue for that Aerie Spears viral moment, hilarious. Please keep the content coming so I can add it to my content. Fair use, remember that. This your boy JTL, AKA Opposite from the North 18. Make sure y'all subscribe and hit the notification bell. We out. Chill.